Shooter put some stuff in there about the escape. He saw Lowell arrest Marty in the rearview mirror, and all he said to Natalie was, step on it. <laughs> I don't care. It sounds good, doesn't it? I mean, listen, the guy used one girlfriend to escape the other. The only thing that John McBain cares about is his gun. Why don't you watch where the hell you go? Gotta go, Briggs. Written lines about me, Manning? Yeah, actually. You care to comment? Yeah, I do. You run that story, you'll regret it. So are you threatening me? I'm just stating the facts. So you said that if I print this story in my newspaper, that I will regret it. It's not a story. Well, I'm just stating the facts. So let me get this straight. So it's not true that you left Marty in the dust while you drove off with your ex-girlfriend? Which part? That Marty got arrested or that Natalie's your ex-girlfriend? I mean, I heard about you pulling her out of the burning car. It's old news. Well, you got that right. So I guess your next step would be taking Natalie to bed. I mean, if you haven't already. And if you do, where does that leave Marty? You still care about me and Natalie so much anyway. I'm, I'm looking out for Marty. Like you did when you held her prisoner. I didn't get her thrown in jail. Yeah, you're still doing that yourself. But when you screwed up your own life so much, maybe you decided to move on to somebody else's. What happened? Taya throw you out? <laughs> nah, you don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I think I do. <laughs> Well, anyway, I gotta call my editor. This story's not out for thing tomorrow. He's fine. You sure you wanna do that? Well, I can get a new editor. What about a new sister? I, what does Vicky have to do with this? How's she gonna feel when you run the story about her daughter? Come here, you. Maybe I won't run the story. Good. I mean, not because it's not true, but because my sister's been through enough already. I think you made a wise decision. Yeah, who cares what you think?